The first two groups that went through this program helped us to identify some advice to give to you before you get started. Number one, find a buddy or a group. Some people are perfectly content to go through the program on their own without too much interaction. That relates to their own learning needs and preferences. But others find that they need some kind of feedback to stay engaged. If this is your first online course, this is something you'll be finding out about yourself. With the self-paced nature of this course, there's no guarantee anyone will be in the course at the same time as you and providing timely feedback. So we recommend that you make the effort to identify people to interact with. Maybe you can find a colleague at work to go through the program at the same time. Or reach out to colleagues on an email discussion list. You can also use the forums within D4O to find other people going through at the same time and try to work in sync with them. Or, if nothing else, get a supervisor, a potential student, or even a family member to review your work periodically and discuss it with you. Number two, try synchronous meetings. Some people find it really helps to talk to other students in real time, to hear their voice or see their face. Number three, set a schedule for yourself. One student said, if it's asynchronous, it's important to block out time on my calendar, like with a synchronous class. Otherwise, I'll put it off forever. Learners who go through without at least setting personal deadlines don't make it very far. Be realistic about your other commitments and work around them. Number four, start at the beginning of the month. Without specific due dates, this will help keep track of weekly expectations and to be starting in sync with other students. Finally, number five, allow for extra time. Life and work get in the way. For your first time through developing online instruction, much of the process will be new to you and will take longer. But don't worry, with practice, you will streamline your process and get faster.